Hello friends namaste welcome to my channel let's make it lovely today i'm sharing the cradle ceremony decor i did for my baby boy's 21st day i couldn't make it as perfect as i planned but i'm glad i did this for my baby's first celebration at home before getting started if you are new to my channel please subscribe and click on the bell icon for notifications First I started with this baby Krishna poster that I got from India. I cut Krishna to shape because I wanted it to look like baby Krishna is sitting on a swing. You may also try printing an image at home if you find a high quality digital image. I'm just going around with my scissors again to make sure the edges are clean. Once I'm happy with the cut I placed the baby Krishna poster on the foam board and traced all around the Krishna using a pencil then I cut it out using an exacto knife I actually planned to use hanging wisteria flowers to give the decor Vrindavan look but I didn't want to buy new stuff and just wanted to use what I had on hand in case you try doing this decor using wisteria flowers please share your images with me on Instagram Next I stuck the cut poster to foam board using mud podge glue. You can also use regular white glue as well. For making the swing I cut out two rectangular pieces of cardboard and stuck them together with hot glue gun to make it thick enough. and i covered the cardboard with brown foam sheet to give it clean look you can also use a wood print paper to cover the cardboard if you can find one next using heavy duty tape i stuck four white fabric garlands to four corners of the cardboard to make it look like a swing Because these are fabric flowers they don't get damaged from the tape. Now this is how the swing looks. Next to make the Krishna poster stand up on the swing I'm cutting two triangular cardboard pieces and attaching them to the back of the foam board. Make sure you hold on to the cardboard until the hot glue dries. Next stick the Krishna on the swing using hot glue gun. Next to dress up my marigold garlands a little bit I made hanging bunches for garland ends. To make this I used pearl string and foam rose flowers. You can also string some beads like I did in one of my previous videos. Simply cut the pearl strings to length then stick the flowers to string end using hot glue. Now gather three strings together and tie them into a bunch using a thread. Next I tied these bunches to marigold garland ends. I also folded the green edge of the garland back onto the garland and secured it with some tape so that it doesn't show out through these pretty hangings. I 
I did this to all my yellow marigold garlands. And for white flower garlands, I just used two bead strings together and tied them at the end of the garlands. Next to decorate the swing, I took a long piece of bead string and made a two layer hanging on the front of the swing as shown here. I simply secured it using a piece of heavy duty tape. Next I added little longer bunches on both sides of the swing. For the backdrop, I used green artificial grass rug from Home Depot. I will leave all the product links in the description box below. To hang this, I poked four holes along one edge of the rug using a bamboo skewer. Next, I put zip ties through the holes and with the help of zip ties, we attached it to the curtain rod. Because I have a single rod backdrop stand, I'm taking the help of my curtain rod. If you have a double rod backdrop stand, you can go ahead and use that. Next, I tied all the garlands to the backdrop stand using small pieces of thread. You can definitely do this backdrop better than this. I just did what I could after 21 days of my surgery. For attaching the Krishna swing, I just tossed the garlands over the backdrop stand and tied them together with a string. I also added another string from underneath the rod to secure it. I've wrapped some string lights around the Krishna swing. Here is a small tip. Always wrap your string lights around a piece of cardboard to prevent them from tangling. I also decorated the front of Krishna swing just like I decorated baby swing using bead strings and foam roses. After I'm done, I covered the top rod of the backdrop stand with yellow marigold garlands using some tape. Stick the marigold garlands only along green stem part to prevent damaging the flowers. Next, I raised the height of the backdrop stand on both sides. Ideally, I would cover sides of the stand using backdrop curtains, but I was running out of time and patience to decorate with a newborn on hand, so I just finished it by adding long fabric garlands to the sides. Next, I added some backdrop lights on both sides. So this is how I decorated for my baby's cradle ceremony on 21st day. You can do this for naming ceremony as well. I hope you find this idea useful. If you like this video, let me know in the comments. If you have any questions, you can leave a comment or text me on Instagram. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and share.